maximum distance. And now this occasionalism where we actually give power back to God. All the power we give it back to God. Like your notion you thought you had power. Why about you forget about that? You have no power in this world. You know, normally, where do you get this power from even? Is it that you ascribe this power to nature? Why don't you just ascribe it to God? Absolutely. It's not like a partial thing. Absolutely, I have no power. Absolutely. Because, okay, where are you getting this power? Why am I getting this power to speak and to make these videos and to move? The scientists will tell me, it's not even me. It is the mito uh, my mitochondria. The my mitochondria and enzymes and things like this convert stuff in your body. You are not in charge of it. You are not the one doing these things anyway. It is either nature, mitochondria. So, who give you power? It is either mitochondria or it is God. If you as an, as an entity, you have no say in these things anyway. Like, you cannot decide these things. Like, I want energy. Let me create energy now. All you can do is put food in your mouth and, uh, and expect something to happen. And so, all of a sudden, mitochondria is there. Those little things, your white blood cells, all these things are literally moving entities. They are on their own doing things that you have no, you are not in charge of it you're just witnessing them happening so why don't you just give all this power to god anyway and that's what i think the asharic position is so let me see what you guys think in the comment section you can see how it can be interpreted that it was against science and you can see how if you think about it deeply it didn't deny causation all of uh entirely what is denying is that entities or creation they have no cause causal power and also what we observe most of the time is correlation. And God can decide it to be another way. And it wouldn't be a contradiction, as you think. Because it wasn't, it wasn't necessary in the first place. Such that it would become a contradiction. So anyway, do you guys understand?